Come here. Stop. We were in McCall last night, so she's super excited. Okay. Chill. She hey. thinks maybe you're taking her somewhere, huh? Please go. Go. <laughs> I'm gonna, tied up. I'm going to grab her leash. Oh. Oh. So what kind of special uh, challenges do the dogs face because yeah, they're out no. here? Like out in the snow and stuff? I guess in, if they're a city dog, what, what um, difference uh, does it make, I guess? Um, do you feel like they're, um, well, do the they Oakley, eat more? Oh no, Oakley actually got more healthy after she came up here. Uh huh. Uh, in her back legs, there's a lot more muscle than there was. Uh huh. But like obedient was. Oh okay. It's kind of uh, yeah. harder to get them to come inside. Oh, because they like the outdoors. Yeah. Uh huh. That's why we pretty much have to keep her Better in leash most of the time. So, so this dog probably is just a little bit more in tune with. Um, environment and stuff like that yeah mm -hmm. are there any um i guess like uh coyotes wolves i don't know there's no yeah. coyotes wolves usually stay towards warren there's foxes there's foxes uh -huh. are they just kind of hunting around looking for things yeah they just yeah. kind of like go through garbage and that kind of okay, stuff okay yeah <laughs> yeah <laughs> that's cool but and how the dogs interact um they don't really come i mean the fox stays like pretty much like back there or like over there uh -huh. um they don't really see them that often but if she hears stuff she'll like bark until it's gone uh-huh <laughs> And then um, snow in their paws and stuff, do they do they just pick it out themselves or do you mm -hmm. feel like you have to do booties or anything no, like that? No, we don't do that. Nope, she's fine. She can sit out here. She hates going inside. Really? Yes. With longer haired dogs like Dujum though, uh -huh. they'll get like snowballs and stuff. Oh yeah, connect, their fur. like all back here and stuff. Oakley doesn't really get them, but... Well, her her coat, Oakley, is like a little bit more like a wolf coat, right? Mm -hmm. Like She has two coats. Okay, so for snow, it actually is pretty good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because it sheds to fluff up more. Yeah, she sheds a lot. <laughs> sheds the um, sheds the snowballs out and stuff. Yeah. Ah, okay. It's really interesting. Yeah. Um, anything like health wise that you have to kind of watch more because you're out? Um, in the winter. Here? Yeah, just because it's so cold. Um, not really like health wise, just like making sure her water's not frozen. <laughs> there you go. That's a thing. Um, yeah. Nothing else really. She does really well, and she loves it out here. Like she. As you can tell, she'll just roll around in the snow for like ever. What kind of diet do you feed them? She eats, um, it's called True Source, and mm -hmm. it has like no grain or anything like that in mm -hmm. it, and it's like $65 for a bag. Yeah. So she really? eats that, and she usually, when she's growing, like going through growth spurts, she'll eat like a bag of that, like a 50 pound bag in like two weeks. <laughs> but, she loves her neck rubs, by yeah, the way. Yeah, <laughs> loves neck rubs. <laughs> yeah, but she looks really healthy. Yeah. She, yeah, she's spoiled rotten. And she gets to run around? Uh -huh, yeah, especially like on slower days, like not the weekends, she'll just run around without a leash or anything. And uh -huh. the goats, she tries to herd the goats and stuff. <laughs> I saw those goats, they're really cute. Get down. Yeah, well it seems like a really nice environment oh. for dogs. Yeah, she loves it, and so does he likes it too. He'll just sit in the snow all day too, even though he's smaller. Yeah. He'll just yeah, lay down and just hang out. Yeah, I've always heard like, you know, snow dogs, they actually aren't bothered too much by the, by the cold. Uh-uh, she loves it. I mean... If it's if we have a fire going in our cabin, she'll like lay on the ground by the door where the air mm -hmm. comes in. So she just she'd prefer to be outside. Right. She doesn't want as much heat. So. Yes. Okay. And when we were in the city, uh -huh. with the house being like 70 degrees all the time, yeah, she'd lay on like the the air conditioning vents, or the, the vents and stuff. Right uh huh. Oh yeah, and that could be her breed more, mm -hmm. I guess. I would. Do you know what they're bred for? Like what kind of environment? Um, I don't know. Well, Is it cold or mountains. hot? Mountains. Mountains. They're supposed to be guarding oh, like sheep and that kind of stuff. That's why she has dew claws. Uh, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Because you can't remove them on Great Pyrenees because mm -hmm. they're connected to the bone. Hmm. Interesting. So, yeah. So, can't remove hers. Okay. Wow, that's really interesting. Look, look show her your dew claws. <laughs> yeah, I actually saw them on yep. her back. Yeah. <laughs> and she's got two. It looks like on yep. one. Do they all have two? I just think just the back ones. Her front ones have one. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah, just one on these ones. Uh-huh. <coughs> cool. Well, thanks, guys. I appreciate it. Yeah, no problem.